These are the leaders of the members of NATO. This is the Prime Minister of Montenegro. And that was US President Donald Trump pushing his way to the front. Several videos of Trump's first foreign visit as president have gone viral, whether he was in Brussels, the Vatican, Israel or Saudi Arabia. And not for the reasons most world leaders would want. There was the greeting with French President Emmanuel Macron, dubbed the white knuckle handshake. You have two strong leaders, and they were showing their physical strength to one another through their handshake. Uh, it wasn't a white knuckle situation, it was described in the press. It was really a mutual strength. But handshakes and shoving aside, Trump was again blunt about the importance of all NATO members sharing the costs of the defense pact. I have been very, very direct with Secretary Stoltenberg and members of the alliance in saying that NATO members must finally contribute their fair share and meet their financial obligations. But 23 of the 28 member nations are still not paying what they should be paying and what they are supposed to be paying for their defense. Before that, there was more online humor. A visit to the Vatican to meet with the Pope is usually followed by a photo opportunity. But the Pope's expression took center stage on the internet. You know, Rex, uh, and then, in Israel, look at the reaction of Ron Derma, Israel's ambassador to the U.S., seen here on the right, when Trump seems to suggest that Israel is not in the Middle East. We just got back from the Middle East. We just got back to Saudi Arabia. and. Uh, uh, we were treated incredibly well. With this being the first of probably many foreign trips to come, observers will be keen to see whether it's Trump's body language or his policies which make the headlines next time. Ben said, TRT World.